This is something I enjoy very much, to work with people who, uh, who, who act for the first time, uh, because you discover a lot <laughs> about themselves and about yourself. <laughs> and, uh, and, uh, and because we were working um, uh, in a different way a little bit, because uh, they didn't read the script. Uh, I told you before they, they didn't read it. So uh, uh, we were trying to, to know. Uh, I was telling them a little bit about the character. And uh, I left them for uh, to improvise. Yeah, to improvise and yeah. to think about the character. Uh, what do they do every day and uh, uh, the their relationships and and some of the dynamics of the scenes. Mm -hmm. It's uh, it's from them actually. It's uh, they were not just um, uh, actors who are coming to say the lines and leave. It's mm -hmm. It was not like this at all. They were a main collaboration in uh, in yeah. making the film. Yeah. Uh, and and they were very inspiring actually i mean because uh, they had a lot of details uh, that they've put uh, they've put a lot of of mm -hmm. themselves in the uh, in the film so um, so it was uh, it was a very nice experience to do this from uh, this film i'd like to move to the good the bad and the politician because mm -hmm. i think that actually that film actually i felt from the way you were talking about it earlier that actually you tend to like it a lot also, it was hard because it uh, was following or within a few days following the revolution. And it actually also acquired a lot of uh, awards as well. Yeah. S yeah. So would you tell us more about it? Um, well, it was um, yeah, during the 18 days, uh, Mohammed mm -hmm. Hevzi, uh, mm -hmm. the producer, had an idea to make a documentary, mm -hmm. a three segments documentary mm -hmm. about the events. Uh, and to get three directors uh, to have three uh, different points of views about what happened and um, and it was like uh, it was the good the bad and the politician the mm. good the people it was about the people uh, the bad it was about the police officers and the politician it was about uh, Hosni Mubarak and mm -hmm. so uh, so uh, you said you did the bad part yeah yeah, <laughs> <laughs> and you mentioned that earlier that it was hard for police officers to open up. So, how was it? How did you find actually dealing with uh, the police in a uh, documentary? And did they accept easily to talk? No, they did not accept <laughs> easily <laughs> at all. <laughs> actually, uh, I mean, I I like uh, I I made interviews with like fifteen officers off the record, mm -hmm. uh, but uh, people who went on camera were four mm -hmm. officers from the 15 which wow. was uh, yani <laughs> yani many of them actually um, uh, after agreeing to be on camera they would send me a message and tell me no uh, oh no we, we can't do it uh, mm -hmm. uh, yani it was not uh, it was not easy at all mm -hmm. especially at the time because mm -hmm. it was right after the 18 days mm -hmm. And the police officers were attacked everywhere, so uh, um, it, it was not uh, easy. Um, but so I was very interested to to talk to them. Um, and actually, when Hazi approached me uh, about this project, uh, uh, this was the part that I wanted to do because um, I was interested in talking to police officers because in, in my daily life, I don't talk to police officers, actually. Uh, I, I have. I usually have nothing to do with them. <laughs> but it was a good. Uh, it was a good way to start <laughs> talking to them. Um, and it was challenging because um, because uh, I wanted to get uh, to know about uh, how did they feel about what happened, uh, how do they perceive uh, us, how they, because I was um, I was talking. Some some of the officers that I met actually were at the same place that I was mm -hmm. uh, in the protest. So uh, and 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 I remember, Yani, uh, especially on the 28th and uh, when we were in the street, that I was thinking uh, and how how are in how do they see us? How do they perceive us? Uh, and it it was a good chance to know. Um, so how did they perceive us? <laughs> no, that's <laughs> very that's very complicated, Yani. I can tell you this <laughs> because uh, uh, the conclusion for me that uh, uh, 
the police officers are really complicated <laughs> <laughs> it's not it's not easy uh, to judge them actually this, um, uh, and most of them uh, I was never convinced by what they said but said that they are convinced of, uh, of, of, of of their cause yes yeah. of course and uh, and uh, and I don't believe that um, it's not that they were wrong. It was uh, that the way they were educated and the way it's uh, it's been conducted here is totally wrong. Mm -hmm. for, for the thing is, you're just um, you're just dealing with someone who's not uh, even when he does wrong things, he's not the only one. You know, it's it's a system. For at a, at a time at a certain time, and uh, yeah, it, um, that's what he was ordered. In other words, yeah, this was. Uh, yani it's not. Um, uh, that's. Uh, you feel it's complicated to explain. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's very complicated, and 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 actually, I had a very complex relationship with them when I was uh, shooting, and during the editing, I it was it was very uh, complex for me because it's not. Uh, it's not easy to have a, an opinion about mm -hmm. about it. Um, so um, I, I was changing my mind every day. Mm -hmm. yeah, one day I said, "No, he's uh, he's okay. He didn't mean anything." And then the next day, no, he's <laughs> they they are mean and <laughs> <laughs> so it it, it was. Um, uh, me and the editor who was working with me, uh, it was like this every day. We were changing our mind every day about <laughs> them. My name is Kamil Mustafa Jamal Abdul Salam. This year, I'm going to go to the hospital. I'm going to go to the hospital. I'm not going to go to the hospital. I'm 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 going to go to the hospital. بس انا مش واقف تشريف على الناس. لا الدوله كانت واخدانا شومه تتعجز عليها او تضرب بيها. فانت دخلت في انزعات مش بتاعتك. اي مشكله في مصر اقتصاديه، سياسيه، اجتماعيه، فئويه. مشكله منقبات، مشكله طيارات سياسيه، تحل حل امني. اصبحت انت عفوية العلبه بتاع الشعب. كفايه ان انا عامل حاجتين. كاتب حريتي ومدي له احساس بالارهاب. تاني حاجه ويمكن انا لو مش موجود هيبقى في ضغط ان في حد ينزل يكلمه. تالت حاجه انت عمال تبهدلني نظام تشغيل غلط بالظبط وصوت وخطيط طبعا ومحسوبيه ووساطه انت بتشتغل زي الطرف السائل. ان انا افضل امن واحد فرد واحد بس عشان يجي يعدي قدامي يروح يزور مكان اقفله بالعشر ساعات وهو بيعدي قدامي زي الطيف يروح المكان بتاعه ويرجع تاني وانا واقف في مكاني في الارض عشان اقفل له حته شارع محدش يرمي عليه ولا نسمع النقادات بتاعتنا المحترمه زمان كان يقول لك دقه عربيه امن المركزي دي ما تعدي في الشارع Actually, if uh, if it was not for the deadline, you might have been still uh, working on oh, it. Yeah, yeah. I think I wouldn't have finished actually, <laughs> because uh, it had a lot of angles, <laughs> and uh, uh, and it was uh, I was against them very mm -hmm. much uh, at the time, and I'm mm -hmm. I'm still against them actually mm -hmm. in a way, uh, but. Uh, but I'm against what they're doing, but I'm not against them personally because mm -hmm. uh, when you deal with them personally, it's totally different mm -hmm. uh, because it's not it's not as easy as it seems. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, another film that you directed is An uh, Arif Yamin, or I know who uh, she is. Would you tell us more about that film? It was um, it was something I was doing for the WHO, okay. um, and it was about al Alzheimer. It w they wanted mm -hmm. to make a project about mm -hmm. um, the supporters uh, mm -hmm. or the caregivers of uh, uh, of the mm -hmm. Alzheimer patients, mm -hmm. as Alzheimer patients. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and um, it was it was this movie was done for for the support uh, mm -hmm. of, of those people. Mm -hmm. So uh, it was uh, it was um, a project I did uh, 
for uh, يعني for a reason it was mm -hmm. something uh, I was asked to do mm -hmm. but so the <coughs> thing is that they were very uh, they gave me freedom to do mm -hmm. the film the way uh, that I want mm -hmm. so uh, I made a, pro uh, a short film that I really like mm -hmm. uh, and uh, and it's not like uh, you're doing something uh, formal and, and it was not like this at all uh, mm -hmm. it was um, uh, I made a research about the Alzheimer patients and the people who stay with them and mm -hmm. uh, their relationship, uh, and then I and I wrote the script for mm -hmm. the film and uh, and it became a film. It was mm -hmm. about characters um, mm -hmm. and about a man and his wife and mm -hmm. uh, uh, he doesn't want to leave her although she doesn't know him. So it was not uh, he was deciding whether or not to leave. Um, so um, so it was in a way. Uh, it it was very human يعني ف uh, the nice things uh, that it it became a, uh, a short fiction mm -hmm. <laughs> and not uh, and not a project يعني mm -hmm. that's yeah. why I, I enjoyed doing it very much and eventually i'm interested to know what did he do did he leave her or not no he didn't oh, that's good. <laughs> uh, it was يعني uh, yeah, it was about the issue of uh, that even if she doesn't know him, he, he just uh, he knows her. Fa yes. fa that yeah. that was uh, the issue. But um, but uh, uh, I got uh, to read a lot about the Alzheimer. Yeah, at the time, and it was uh, very enriching because I I was not into it before, mm. so it was uh, it was uh, a good experience also. <laughs> Was it hard because actually Alzheimer cases are quite severe cases and mm. it can be hard shooting. Was it psychologically hard on you working? Uh, Did you feel sad so that it made you feel that you you cannot work as efficient or it was or yeah, during shooting it was very easy actually. Uh -huh. it was, it was I didn't have a problem in shooting it. it uh, so I think it was during the research that mm -hmm. uh, when you you see bad cases and you you get to know. Uh, um, and uh, the doctor who was responsible for this, he was telling me a lot of stories. Uh, mm -hmm. So um, it was very touching, actually. Uh, mm -hmm. So, uh, and uh, and the thing is that uh, taking care.